because I. Are you serious? Lol. It was so quiet the whole time. We've been talking oh, for like an man. hour and it was dead silent. Okay, guys. There's gonna be construction uh, going on in the background, so please understand. And we had no idea it was gonna be construction before, but yeah, we have Taylor today. I'm in Korea. Oh, she's visiting. She's here for a few days. Yeah, just till Saturday. So, what do you think about Korea so far? I have been here before. I came often for Japanese visas because they can do ah, them in one day. Right, right, right. But because of that, I didn't spend much time in Korea, oh, really? and I always came in the winter when it was crazy cold, or in the summer when it was crazy hot. So. Yeah, I didn't really explore it. This time I arrived last night and I did a lot of walking around mm. and the weather is perfect right now It's super cute. It reminds me a lot of Japan like a lot of different neighborhoods really right. cute shops really cute cafes It's very clean mm -hmm. and people are very friendly mm. and everyone's so like Everyone's so pretty. Everyone really? has really good skin. I don't know if it was just the areas I was in, but in general, I felt a little bit insecure because really? no, guys. When I was walking around the shops, everyone's skin is so clear and healthy and glowing, really? and everyone's makeup and fashion is so on point. And oh. my skin is not the best. No. This lighting is good. No, but no, no. I have no. a lot of hormonal. Acne. Taylor, Taylor is like absolutely gorgeous. I don't know what she's on about. No. Now. We've decided to uh, do what's in our makeup pouch. Oh, I have hair. Yeah. Oh, well, <laughs> mine too, mine too. <laughs> We're gonna show you guys what we have in our makeup pouch. I think it will be really interesting because uh, we have different style of makeup yeah. and uh, we probably use different brands as well. Yes. So, um, yeah, because you're the guest. And I've never done this before, oh, really? even on my channel. No, this is oh. very new to me. Okay, mm. so. What did you go first? Okay, so my pouch is about. That's really cute. <laughs> it's about three years old. A viewer sent it to me, oh. um, and I still use it, but it's quite dirty inside. Ooh. I actually was meaning to buy a clean new one just for this video, <laughs> really? but I, it got too busy last night, and I didn't get home to like one. So then I didn't have time. But so yeah, this is a this is a realistic, very dirty makeup pouch. I'm gonna start at the bottom, maybe. Okay. With foundation. Ooh. So I use the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter. Hydrating Longwear Foundation. I just got this recently. I'm the color 100. <laughs> yeah. I find when I put this on, it looks a bit light, but it oxidizes a little bit, oh. and it's quite hydrating because I have very dry skin. I tried her other foundation, and it was too drying. It would cling to all the dry spots. Mm -hmm. So this one is um, pretty good for me. It works Ooh. well. I've been seeing this one around on Instagram. I should try it out. Fenty Beauty recently just started launching here. So yes. I'm definitely gonna check it out real soon. Oh my god! This in is Hong so Kong too, because we just got Sephora, so that's why I'm all stocked up on Fenty. You're gonna see in a second. <laughs> okay. For me, I only have one base, and it's the Cosrx Sunny Snail Tone Up Cream. I recently. Oh my god! No shame, guys. No shame. Self promoting right here. Hello. Is that the one you gave me? Yes. Yay. It's the Sunny it. Snail Tone Up Cream. So what it is is basically helps you to tone up. You can use it as a primer, base on its own. Also, you can use it to match your foundation if it's too light, and you can apply on your neck instead of using foundation because sometimes when you use like turtlenecks it tends to get on to it get on around it yeah typically other tone up creams they don't have uh, SPF Ooh. and they're just tone up cream so yeah that's I wanted really important to, yeah and I wanted to make like more benefiting to our skin so we added snail mucin to it because it helps with anti-aging and also um, it helps to fight like acne scars um, Ooh, I so, need that yeah I wanted to have everything in tone up cream. that's amazing so it's a treatment as well as makeup at the same yes. time so yeah so one that looks really good. <laughs> no shame. I'm sorry, guys. PPL. Ooh. My absolute favorite concealer, forever and always, is the NARS Creamy Concealer. Oh, is it really that good? Yeah, in light number one, Chantilly is a color I use. Oh. Yeah, I. It doesn't really. It's it's very smooth and creamy. Doesn't get trapped in fine lines. Really? And yeah, I just love the way it looks. I've seen a lot of people that I know use this concealer. I've never got my hands it's on it. It's been a staple for oh, years. Oh really? For me. Yeah. I should get this one when I'm. Yeah, I've tried so many, but I, I always go back to this This one? one? Oh, okay. Well, Radiant Creamy Concealer, everyone. Mm. So, yeah. I typically don't carry a lot of base. I only carry one. And I'm one of those people, I don't carry any mirrors. I don't like touching up. It's weird. Oh. I really don't like touching up in public. I typically go to bathroom and do it, but that's really rare for me. And usually when I'm carrying around um, makeup pouch, I have a lot of lip products. 
like I have, oh wow I have a lot like <laughs> this much guys I like to carry or uh, carry around a lot of different type of um, lipstick liquid lipsticks in general because you know every day our moods are different and sometimes in the morning we wear pink and at night we want to wear red ones right oh, so okay. I like carrying a different one the first one I have is the Dior ultra care liquid this one is really pretty I love how this one has like infused flower oil so if you have dry lips oh. this one really helps to kind of moisturize your lips at the same time it gives you really nice color so I really like this one out. Recently, Wake Make, it's a Korean brand. They did a collab with Kango. Do you know Kango? Oh, like the fashion brand? Yeah. Okay. Oh my god, this is like the best collaboration I've ever seen in my life. Oh yeah, that's really pretty. So creamy. Yeah. And, and um, it's soft. Yeah. And also, Wake Make is really famous for their lip products because they're really long lasting and oh the color god. is really pretty. And it's soft too, like it's, it's not. So it's so soft. Not, it looks different than a usual lipstick. Yeah. Red yeah. <laughs> I have a lot of reds. I really love You're reds. Big on reds. Yeah. And then um, this one is one of their uh, tints as well. I, I really like kind of like brick red, like orange brick color. Oh, wow. Yeah. These are like one of my favorite like reds to go. Um, for this fall and Hera, they recently released fall collection. I really love their packaging yeah. and I love their quality, especially the central tint line. They last really long and uh, the colors are really pretty. So this is like my kind of color. This nude. Right? Yeah. Oh my god, this is really pretty. <gasps> yeah, this one is in color Pampas. 435 and then this one is in 350. This one is really pretty. Like it's almost like an orange reddish color. You definitely have a color scheme though. Yeah, like. <laughs> I always I only go around this color. I don't go for like really bright colors like um, too reddish because it doesn't really complement my skin tone. Alright. Then the next one I have is the YSL. I think this is their latest release. Their water stain in number six one seven. This one is more on the mauvey pink. Oh, that's really nice. Oh, it's very really liquidy. Cool. Yeah, I convinced Charlotte to get this one as well. So she recently just got this. Mm -hmm. And then um, this one is one of my favorite lip oil from MAC. And it's their Shot Off Color Lip Oil oh, in color heard so full on. I think this is only Asia exclusive. Oh. Yeah, so um, if you guys want to get it, definitely um, get it when you're in Asia. It's really nice blue tone red. I think blue tone reds are really pretty for any skin tone, so they're very universally flattering. So if you guys want to get reds, try to go for like the blue ones. Then that's it for lips. <laughs> that's it. Just, that's just, it for just lips. go 10. Yeah. <laughs> but I noticed a lot of your products do many things in one. Yeah. And that's what I really like about you. That's why I, I always ask you. Oh, really? I tell you, like, what should I use? I'm big on the Kylie cosmetics. You know, you know what's funny? When I, when I first subscribed to Taylor, I actually ordered the Kylie uh, lip kits oh, because of you. <laughs> I was like, oh my god, I actually bought six. Exactly like the colors that you recommend. I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna get this, this, and this. <laughs> okay. and, wait, wait, what is this? Is this the this is a newer one. Oh. This is Bear. Oh, Bear? Um, so I'm still using them after many years. I'm a, I'm a big fan of using the same things for a long time. The same oh. bags. I don't change up my products a lot. Oh, really? I often go back to like the same things. Oh. But um, unlike the ones you said, this one, it doesn't really treat your lips. It's a little bit more on the drying side. Ah. But I really love um, the colors. And because I like to overline my lips, mm -hmm. it kind of... Because if I use something too shiny or oily, you can really see right, where right, I right, overline. Right. So this kind of works for that. But oh, yeah, these are, this is a color bear, and that's oh, what I have on really now. Cute. And yeah, oh my gosh, I didn't so bring cute. much um, color selection or many different makeups because I'm just traveling here for mm -hmm. a few days. So I just bought brought my um, necessities. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so oh, that's the latest. Um, I have extra battery for my G7X oh. and then I have oh yeah I've been really into the Kango collection actually I was I was pretty skeptical about it because usually when clothing company uh, do a collaboration with uh, beauty brands in Korea they I don't really like them it's more the packaging's nice yeah. but the product's not the yeah. greatest but yeah. I think Kango and Wake Make did a really great job in like a product selection this time around and a lot of their products are really good including their eye glitters yeah, I it's so later. pretty. You should, you should. Because it's it. a mixture of chunky and small, and mm. it, it looks. I don't know if it captures well on camera, but it looks so good in person. It, it catches the light, and it's oh, it's so blingy. I feel like this color will really complement your skin tone as well. Oh, wow, wow. Yeah, so this one is in case you guys are wondering, it's number seven. 
So yeah, I love I it. Really love eye glitter. And then the next one, I think I really like Wake Make. I have a lot of Wake Make products. I have their um, eyeliner. This is any proof pen liner in brown. Cause sometimes when it's really hot, it smudges. Any eyeliner smudges. So yeah. I tend to touch up with um, eyeliner. Yeah. And then for eyebrow pencil, this one is heavy rotation. I feel like Japan has really good eyebrow mascara and eyebrow pencil in yeah. general. So yeah, I got. Uh, I have the heavy rotation coloring eyebrow in number seven, and this one is in number one. So that's it. I don't have any more. Oh, okay. <laughs> I hmm. I'll, I'll show something sparkly. My what favorite, the Fenty Beauty Diamond Balm. Ooh. It is so sparkly. Oh my god, that is so pretty. So I love it on anything. I love it in the corner of my eyes. It, it really like makes them bling. Oh my god, and then that's really pretty. Or as eyeshadow, a little bit on the top, or even on your highlight area or on your body. It, it, it looks so nice everywhere. Packaging is really pretty yeah. too. Fenty Beauty is always really good at everything. Um, next up, let's do eyebrows. Oh, I'm a big oh, fan of that. Girl. Yeah. So I actually did microblading on my eyebrows, but the thing with microblading when they put the original color, it kind of because it's like a tattoo, it goes sort of under your skin and so a layer of your skin is on top. And when it heals, it tends to go a bit gray toned. Mm -hmm. um, so I got this one because it's a bit warmer. So I just sort of fill this in a little bit to warm up my brows a bit because my natural hair is a bit more warmer toned. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I'm using this one in the color three. Oh. And I like this one because they have this at the end. So it yeah. just makes it really hey, easy. Hey, did you know um, if you use like, um, if you wear um, eyeshadow glitter and then let's say if you add a little bit like too much on this side, you can use this to kind of Oh, and yeah, I do that glitter. for when the mascara falls. Yeah, yeah, but for glitters, it's glitters a lot too. easier. Because <sighs> yeah. that's how I do mine whenever I apply too much. I just like get rid of the glitters with that. This one? Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, this one is the Gimme Brow, so this is how I set them in place. It has a little bit of color, and then Ooh. it makes them look a little bit thicker. Oh, okay. Because it coats it with the color. I feel like Benefit has really good like brow products. They're, yeah, yeah. they have really good eyebrow stuff. Yeah. Um, and then, Ooh. eyeliner, a Japanese brand. Kiss Me? Oh yeah, heroin really make famous. waterproof. Yeah, I really love this one. Ooh. Also, um, another Japanese brand mascara, the Majolica Majorca Lash Expander Edge Meister. Wait, isn't this one quite hard to remove though? Yeah. Yeah. But I like it because oh, it really? sticks. It, it it has little fibers in it. Uh, I've been using this one for years, so it makes your eyelashes thicker, longer. It kind of adds eyelash extensions oh. onto them, but then you can remove it at night. So what I hate about eyelash extensions is if they're really hard to clean, yeah, and then stuff gets stuck too. in it. Yeah, yeah. But this one almost gives you the look of lash extensions, but you can remove it at night. It's a little bit hard, but yeah. you can definitely do it. Mm. Um, it's good oh. and it's waterproof. I'll, I'll recommend you some Korean mascaras that you can try out that is also like similar yeah, but similar. easier to remove. Yeah. Okay. And then I like to line my waterline with a beige oh, eyeliner. What is this? This is just Makeup Forever in the color 500 mm. because I find beige makes the white of your eyes pop out more so it kind of makes your eyes look a bit bigger. Right, right, right. Ah, I see. So I always line my waterline with this every wow. day. It's Even nice if I don't wear eyeliner, just like mascara, I'll still put this in wa my waterline. Oh, so this is like it one of your eyes brighter. Have. Yeah. Ooh. And then this I got recently. My friend Blair just came to Hong Kong and she brought me this. I didn't even know Armani has this blush, but it's a liquid blush in the color 50. Uh -huh. um, but it's super... It's so pretty. Yes. So because my skin is so dry, when I put powder and then powder blush, you can really see my pores a uh, lot more. Um, my skin is still dry, but I find when I use this liquid blush, it just gives a natural light glow, but then it keeps my skin texture okay. Like it's not too drying and doesn't like cling to my pores. So I love this. <laughs> it's really interesting to see other people's like makeup polish because like they're so different. Like yeah, ours, ours are really different. Yeah. Our color tones, everything. I feel I like you like more on the neutral like lips. Yeah. Nude, yeah. Nude. Um, another Fenty Beauty. This is my bronzer. Oh wow, this is really nice. It's not. It's not like not too glittery. strong. Yeah, and not yeah more matte and kind of light in color, so it's not too harsh. Mm. Um, it's in the sun. In the sun. That's cute. That's, That's a color. cute name. Oh, I just got it. I was like, in, it's in the sun. Yeah, yeah, yeah. In the sun. In the sun. In the sun. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I'm almost really done nice. here. This is my powder, my pressed powder, Charlotte Tilbury. Is it good? I've always heard about this brand though. I love 
I actually don't have a lot of stuff with me today, but I love her lip stuff. I love her powders. I love her foundations. I love a lot of things. I just happened to like buy this as a new thing that I've been using, but yeah, she's another brand that I go back to a lot. Oh wow, I should check it out. Oh, and in Hong Kong, they have their own shops now, a lot of them, so it's becoming very popular there too. Oh wow, yeah, I like it. My concealer is RMK from Japan. Oh. It's very used up and gross. <laughs> um, but Holy grail, huh? There used to be, yeah, I bought this so many times. This is probably oh, like my wow. fifth or sixth palette, but this is one I carry with me because they have two colors that you can sort of mix depending on where you're putting it. They have the powder just to like blot things out throughout the day. And there's usually a brush here, but it fell out a while ago. Um, but yeah, I really like this compact. Well, I noticed that well. Taylor bring like the whole like her whole like makeup. I did because that's what I thought you wanted. <laughs> oh no 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 no! Um, for me like what I, I don't think... usually carry. Usually really? all I carry around is a concealer and a lip thing, and that's ah. it. That's the only thing I'll touch up because I like to touch up under my eyes. Sometimes I get some black here, mm. and my lips. That's it. This is all that would normally be in my bag. Ah, I see, I see. I see. But I thought that would be very boring and quick. Oh, yeah, for that's you. true. That's true. <laughs> well, thank you for showing us everything because I've always been curious what she carries because I love like I subscribed to Taylor like a long time ago before it. We actually knew each other. That's why I bought a lot of like Kylie stuff because you were raving about it. So I've always wanted to see what's in your makeup bag, oh, and that's why I wanted stuff? to film this video because like it's it's really interesting to see what other people carry. It is, especially yours, because I love your recommendations. Oh really? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that, that was really fun. I really <laughs> like the, the products you show because a lot of stuff I've never heard about. Yeah, so and uh, a lot of a lot thing. of these are like the new products because mm -hmm. I like reviewing new products for. That's. That's where we differ. So you like trying new things, which is really good to discover. I'm I always stick to what I know and like, and I don't really. I'm not and especially you like black pink, right? And Hera, uh, Jenny is a new uh, model for oh, Hera. Oh yeah, I saw that. Yeah. <gasps> okay. I'm sold. Really, their foundation is really good too. If you're really into like semi matte, really like high coverage uh, foundation. Yeah, you need high coverage. Hera black foundation is really good. Okay, yeah. I really want to check that let's, out. Let's let's go now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, we're gonna head out and shop. If you guys want to see the vlog side of it. Don't forget to check out Taylor's. Yeah, video. we're gonna do I'll a shopping one. Below. Oh, sorry, yeah. I just cut you off. <laughs> no worries, no worries. We're, do shopping we're one really now. chill. That's why we're like, uh, I think uh, once in a while we kind of cut off each other. But you know, guys, we're friends, so don't worry about it. Don't get, <laughs> don't get mad in the comments. Down and below. We're we just haven't really seen cute. each other in so long. I know. So we're just, like, very excited. We're like, I know. <laughs> we're just back and forth. We're like back catching forth. up like the whole time. So yeah, if you guys haven't checked out Taylor's channel, don't forget to check it out. I'm sure a lot of you guys already subscribed to her. Thank you so, so much. Yeah, and also don't forget to check out her video. Um, I'll link it down below and I'll put it right here if I can I think. Can we actually put like other people's video here? Oh, anyway. It might be there. Yeah, I'll link <laughs> it on the yet. description box below and we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye. Oh, that was fun. That was so easy and chill. Yeah, that was really easy. That was like the easiest video I've ever filmed. I feel bad for my editor. <laughs> Fighting. <laughs> Fighting Gaya, Natalie. In Chinese, it's like add oil. Yeah. Fighting Natalie. Oh, you say fighting here yeah. in Korea, right? Yeah. Gaiao. Gaiao? In Cantonese. Gaiao. Gaiao.